What's up YouTube, Tactical Suite here once again. Thanks for watching. So a quick call to action for you guys today. I'm sure everybody has heard by now the new YouTube policy regarding becoming a YouTube partner or really being able to monetize your channel. Um, they decided to put a threshold on who can monetize and that is you have to have a thousand subscribers and at least 4,000 hours of watch time over the last 12 months. Um, what that means is there's a lot of guys out there right now that have monetized channels under the old system that once the deadline hits, I think it's mid-February, I forget the exact date, but once that date hits, if they don't reach those limits, um, their channels are going to get reverted to just a normal non-monetized channel. Um, and there's a lot of people out there that say, uh, well, when you have those small numbers, you're not really getting any money anyway, so it's not a big deal. And I kind of said that at first too, I was like, yeah, you're not really making that much. But then I started thinking about it. There's a lot of extra tools and functionality that YouTube gives you as a YouTube partner that, in my opinion, is more valuable than the money that you're getting at that point. You know, if you only have a couple hundred subscribers, yeah, you're not making any money. Um, you may go months before you see a paycheck. But those tools that they give you are very useful. Uh, they're very helpful in growing your channel. So that's what I don't like about this. I don't like the way YouTube is going about this. Um, if they want to set new limits on this, it's fine. I get what they're doing. But the way they're going about it, as usual, I don't like it. Um, they should have said, okay, from this point on, this is the new rules. Anybody else that already had a monetized channel under the old system should have been grandfathered in. It's not right to take something away from them because they don't fit your new rules. Um, it's not right to do that. It's not right to take those tools away from those people. And in reality, even though it's not a lot, it's not right to take that money away from people. YouTube is making money off of their videos by putting ads on it, and you're telling them that they can't have their piece of that money uh, because they don't meet your new guidelines. Uh, I don't like it. I think YouTube really should have grandfathered these guys in. But as it stands, once the deadline comes, if they don't meet those limits, they're going to get reverted to a non-monetized channel. So what I'd like you guys to do, and I've mentioned this before in, in some other videos, um, on my main channel page here, over on the side, I have this bar that says support small gun channels. And all the small channels I interact with that I watch, um, I list them on there. It's, it's randomized, so like every time you refresh, it'll be a new list of people. Um, but the better way to do this, if you go here to where it says channels, click on that, and then where it has all channels drop down and click that featured channels and it's going to list all of those channels. What I would like you guys to do, go on there, find these guys that are under a thousand, um, especially the guys that are really close, you know, they're 800s, 900s, go onto their channels and subscribe. I would love to bump these guys up to a thousand so they don't lose out on these tools and the money that's due to them. Um, like I said, I don't like the way YouTube's doing it, but this is the way it is. So let's help these guys out, try and bump their numbers up before the deadline, and get them to stay monetized. All right, guys, that's all I got today. Like I said, just a quick call to action. As always, if you like what I'm doing, give me that thumbs up. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button over there. Stay up to date with any new videos we got coming out. We will catch you next time. Till then, live life and have fun out there.